Hey you, are you tired of the same food being served at the same table with the same nutrients since it's the same food? Do you want to try something new, exciting, and very unhealthy that it would kill you in the next 30 years because of diabetes? Are you a person with an emotionless face, thinking about grabbing a knife in the kitchen, going outside, and stabbing someone so hard the internal organs would come out? Then it is time for you to learn to make your noodles. Or in other words, how to make your instant noodles a delicacy. Step 1 is to clean yourself up to its full cleanliness. Because you don't want any bad bacteria sticking on your food, unless if you're going to make your own food inside your own house, then this reasoning is irrelevant for the video anyway. The next step is to gather your ingredients. Whether you have OCD or not, it is important to gather each and every ingredient necessary for the meal that you are making, no matter how deadly and how unhealthy the ingredients are. Bring out your frying pan. The reason behind it is because I'm also going to make some eggs later. I'm just too lazy to wash too many dishes. Grab a glass or mug and fill it with water. Pour two glass in the pan and let it boil. And once it does, add in your noodles. While the noodles boil, sneak into your neighbor's house and grab some Colby Jack cheese. Go back to your house undetected. This is Colby Jack cheese. It's not something illegal. Check if your noodles is done. If it is, drain the water and add your dry seasonings. Since the liquid seasoning is very, very bland in flavor, add two tablespoons of soy sauce and a generous amount of oil. Now mix well. Put your noodles in the plate and add oil to the frying pan for the eggs. Now it's up to you whether you want your eggs as sunny side up, scrambled, omelette, burnt, crepe, it's up to you. Then add your cheese as toppings. Then toss it in the microwave to melt the cheese. Now finally, unveil your creation. And now for a transition to make it mouth-watering.